Hi, my name's Dave Ferrier, aka Sales Samurai. I'm a multiple international award-winning professional speaker and sales trainer. You know, in the eyes of big cities in Australia, Adelaide is a small country town, but businesses that survive here survive anywhere. Adelaide is a testing ground. Have you ever thought of going into business? One in five businesses survive in their first year. Are you a salesperson or a business owner? Or are you looking for a career change? Businesses survive on sales and people's mortgages are on the line. We don't help businesses survive, we help them thrive! Samantha? David, we have a sexy sales rescue. David, we need a sexy sales rescue now. Sun shining, phone's ringing, I just can't get anything across the line. We need a sexy sales rescue. Sales Samurai, sales Samurai. Let's take the Ferrari. summer the phone is ringing but they're not making the most of it I know that Simon Mueller has heard me professionally speak before I'm excited to be here because I know we can increase sales conversions Simon uh, how are you mate awesome you great to see you likewise good to see you too looking forward to our uh, sexy sales rescue here are you excited yes I'm excited how excited I'm excited are you excited one two excited. three go I'm excited what I'm going to do here is I'm going to make a phone call right now to Mule Air Conditioning and we're going to see how they actually answer the phone and how we can improve that answering the phone so we can increase sales conversions. So I'm going to make a phone call right now. Welcome to Mule Services, this is Leah. Leah, I'd like to organise a quote for an air conditioner please. I'll need to take your details in the first instance and then we can get the salesperson to give you a call back if that's okay because I don't have their details in front of me. Unbelievable. It's quite amazing that I just made a phone call and she said I will take the message and give it to the salesperson. Now the salesperson just told me that they ring back two, three days later and see if they can make an appointment. So this is atrocious. So I'm going to make another phone call and see if I can actually get one of the salespeople now. So I'm now put on hold. Being put on hold, you'll actually lose a great deal of business. Hello, Simon speaking. Yeah, looking to organise a uh, quote for an air conditioner, please. 
One of the things is when you're actually organising an appointment is to make sure you're in front of the decision makers, the husband and the wife. If you've got 10 appointments and you're in front of two decision makers, you're not going to have a high conversion rate. So what the salesperson just did then, Simon, is he organised an appointment to come out and see me. My wife's not going to be there, so I can't make a decision without her being there. There are some fundamental problems in this business and they're easy to fix and we're going to make a 100% increase in sales. Thing. Oh, thank you very much. Are the bedrooms? Yeah. Is, is this one story or two story? Okay, so 8,300 is a little bit out of budget. Um, we can't afford that really at the moment. So, okay, uh, so thanks, Simon, for, for the quote. Uh, I'll, I'll just have a discussion with my husband, see which one should be chosen and yes. um, what to be want exactly. And uh, I will get back to you. No worries. Have a very nice day. Okay. Yeah, sure. Happy? Okay. Uh, This is the second time I've been out to Mueller Air Conditioning. We've got the whole sales team in there now. We've actually had a look at the way that they're doing the phone. They're answering the phone calls. We also looked at the way that they're organising the appointments. They're not in front of the decision makers. Okay, we've been out and had a look how Simon Mueller is out in front of the customer. I've got my whiteboard. We're going to run a brainstorming session. We're going to put some robust sales systems in place. We're going to make a 100% increase in sales. I'm excited. So what we're really working on here, guys, is we're working on three conversion rates. We're looking at the telephone call to appointment sales conversion. Telephone call to appointment. The second one is what we're looking for is the decision maker. The conversion rate of the amount of appointments that you've got to the amount of decision makers you're in front of. A huge and crucial part of sales is the conversion rate of appointment to decision maker. Also what we're looking at is the conversion rate of appointment to sale. These are the three areas we're going to look at. Okay, this is what we're going to do today. It's going to be great fun. It's going to be great. Are you ready? Yes. Sure. Let's do it. Are you ready? Let's do it. And this is something that you need to know as well. Make a huge impact, a huge impact in sales when you increase the conversion rate of appointment to decision maker. So what we're really looking at here is we're looking at the introduction, the presentation and the closing sequence. Okay? We're looking at formulating a top introduction, a top presentation and a top close, reflecting back what they're saying. One, to check on accuracy, and two, as a courtesy to them, to give them an indication that you've actually listened. And it's a powerful thing to do. But not only in sales, it's a powerful thing to do in your life. It's a powerful thing to do with your children. But let's go into the presentation, shall we? At the moment, you haven't got a presentation folder. We haven't got unique selling benefits of company, product and service. What we want to do is put them together and have something robust. Have something out of control that will take the prospect on a journey. A journey into Mueller air conditioning and what we can really do. Sales isn't really about sales. Sales is about personal growth. You know, it's about the conversation you have with yourself. It's about being present, it's about reflectively listening. And that goes into all facets of your life. And what we've come up with is the great unique selling benefits of company, product and service, and we've come up with visual aids to match it. So we can have a presentation folder. Having battle plans for common objections is important for any top salesperson. Okay, you can either give up, you can wing it, or battle plan it. And what we want to do is form some battle plans for the common objections. Now, the common objections, we've already worked out, there are two major ones, and that is, oh, I'll think about it and I'll get back to you. Okay? There's also the price objection. Well, it's a bit out of our budget at the moment, but thanks for coming. What we've done is we've worked on the telephone process so we can make the most of the conversion rate of incoming telephone call to appointment. We've worked on a script so we can get in front of more decision makers. And we've also put the introduction, the presentation, and the closing sequence together. Now, I'm really excited about this being put together. We've got a project manager that's going to work on it. I'm excited! Yes!
Thanks for your time today. It was great. Thank you. Thank you. No worries. Thanks. See ya. See ya. We're here at New Air Conditioning. This is like the fourth time we've been here. I'm excited to be here. We've worked on the three conversion rates. We've worked on the conversion rate, a telephone call to appointment, appointment to decision maker, and appointment to sale. I'm excited to hear what Simon has to say about the increase in sales. Fantastic stuff. Hey, it's the man! Dave! Look who's in the geese! It's the end of summer and sales have definitely doubled. Mate, that's exactly what we wanted to hear. Are you excited? I'm excited. Are you excited? I can't hear you. Are you excited? I'm excited. Fantastic, mate.